All right, guys. Welcome back to another episode of AEW Fight Forever Road to Elite Mode. Um, in this episode, we are going to get our motivation back up. And um, we're going to wrestle. You know, I just used that mood booster. And uh, this episode is sponsored by Dr. Pepper. We're gonna wrestle on. We're gonna start off. We're gonna wrestle on Rampage, and we're gonna try to get warmed up for exploding barbed wire death against John Moxley. We got Cage making his way to the ring. Yeah, guys, Dr. Pepper's always been a mood booster for me. Breaker by Cage. Who better? Boom. Could not. We could not hit that on Eddie Kingston. Fuji. Fuji wore armbar. Locked in. Is Cage going to give it up? Middle of the ring. He's got nowhere to go. Uh, Darby goes away from it. Boom! Big DDT. Let's get him right up, right up into the code red. Boom. Brian Cage is in trouble in this match. And I'm trying to get to the top rope. You might not want to do that. Oh boy! He crumpled us with that German suplex. Here we go. Stun dog. Into the pin. He's not in the ropes. Are we going to get him here? He kicked out. I thought he might. I really thought he might. Big Saito suplex. Rope break, prick. I thought we might have him on that Saito. Oh, Cage with a sick power bomb. Here we go. We're going to see if we can beat him with this code red right here, right now. Into the cut, directly into the cover. Cage in danger. Rick Knox taking his sweet time. But we got him. We got him. Darby Allen gains momentum back on Rampage, defeating Brian Cage. Revolution is just around the corner. Exploding barbed wire death match. Darby Allen, John Moxley. You'd be a fool to miss it. Uh, I guess my Taz could probably use some work. I don't sound I don't sound angry enough. I think that's I think that's my problem. I don't sound angry enough. All right, we are gonna go out, guys. Sightseeing. Right, let's see him punk again. I'm not quite the baseball fan you are. Ain't that the truth, punk? but I appreciate the invite. I try to see as many games here as I can. 
Now that we're on the road, that number has gone down significantly. Should I assume you're going to be fiending for a hockey outing at some point, too? Whoa there. Don't count your chickens. Let's see how good of company you are first. Come on. I don't want to miss the first pitch. Here's the first pitch. Let's take a picture before we go in. All right. Not realistic. CM Punk never takes pictures that good. <laughs> Not realistic at all. We are going to go out and eat. Wesley's Headbutt Restaurant. In Wesley's Headbutt Restaurant in Chicago. Let's get our head in the game. Here's your Chicago deep dish. Wait, is this just for you? No friends to help you eat it? Nah, it's just me. But if you're hungry, take a slice. Okay then. Well, enjoy. Get in my no. <laughs> oh, that looks so good though. That looks so good though. We do a meet and greet because we are wasting our time with these mini games. Pro Wrestling Tees in Chicago, Illinois. New turn. Any advice for someone who wants to become a wrestler? Get in the gym, find a school, and be prepared to bust your butt. You can meet Darby now. Wrestling looks like it really hurts. It really does. Every move could be our last. This place is pretty awesome, right? Who thought cotton would become the lifeblood of our industry? Wrestling fans make a pilgrimage here from all over the world. They were pumped to see you outside the ring. Thanks for coming. Sure, no problem, Matt. Alright, pay-per-view, guys. Let's do it. John Moxley, Darby Allen, exploding barbed wire death match. It's Sunday night, and you know what that means. AEW Revolution coming to you live from Sears Center Stadium. or Wintrust Arena Tonight or the United Center, maybe. A bar none, the most infamous, unpredictable match in AEW history. The exploding barbed wire death match. Thanks, Jim. Hit my music. The following contest is an exploding barbed wire death match. How are you going to do a counter? Making his way to the ring, Darby Allen. Let's do this thing. And his opponent, Jim Moxley. Moxley, we already pinned him once. <laughs> Sizing each other up. playing. Great headbutt. Moxley's taking a shot. This ain't what we want. This ain't what we want. Oh, that, that 
definitely ain't what we want. He's just absorbing these shotgun drop kicks. Oh boy. Oh no. Not run him into into this exploding stuff. We got beheaded on that one. I'm in trouble now. I'm in trouble now. Oh boy. There we go. That's just what we needed. Here we go. Time to go for it. Time to go for it. Stun Dog, Millionaire, Darby Allen, right into the cover on the barbed wire. We got him. Oh, we did it, guys. We did it. We won the exploding barbed wire death match. John Moxley makes it 0 2 in exploding barbed wire death matches. Darby Allen with the Stun Dog, Millionaire, after running him into the bar exploding barbed wire ropes. We got it done, guys, and now we're really on the road, hopefully to a title shot and really making this whole uh, thing, this whole Road to Elite mode, bringing it all the way back around from zero to hero, not what Shawn Michaels said about Bret Hart, from zero to hero. Let's do this, guys. I am pumped. Darby proved prophetic, not only winning an exploding barbed wire death match, but making it one for the ages. Woo, we did it. Draining, draining. Coward referee. Ooh. I forgot about this. Guys, this match was actually great. I think people forget about it because of what happened afterwards, but this was actually a very, very good match. Omega went face first in the explosion. Oh, God. Not if John Moxley hits the paradigm shift. Nice block! Oh, oh. Oh. Kenny took that in the eyes, I think. He just muscled John Moxley Gosh, into that, the ropes. Scream. Gallows and Carl Anderson getting battered by Moxley. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> oh my God! I told you there'd be a surprise, and this is it. Yeah, that match was actually a really great match. Of course, unfortunately, the exploding thing at the end happen the way it did and that's all anybody ever remembers but that match was actually really good
Tony Khan, the exploding barbed wire death match. Holy, you know the rest. We all knew it would be intense, but would anyone expect that? Huge props to Darby Allen for winning a grueling battle for the ages. Yes, sir, the road to double or nothing. Block 4B, challenge yourself. From Chicago to New York City. Welcome to New York. No longer new, fashionable editor, whatever. Alright, guys. With that, I hope we're on the road to some kind of title shot or something at Double or Nothing. But we did it. We went into no we went into Revolution. Um, we we beat John Moxley in an exploding barbed wire death match, and I'm glad that it all worked out because uh, after after full gear, no lie, this is this whole this whole playthrough was starting to look like a failure after we lost to that bulldog. But we were able we beat we beat Chris Jericho. Um, by a count, by a count out, we beat Sting. We beat we beat we won three way Kenny Omega and Moxley, and then uh, we had a little hiccup with Eddie Kingston. We beat um. Uh, oh crap! It was the start of this whole thing. Who did we beat on ramp? Oh, we beat. Who did we beat on rampage? Oh, we beat Brian Cage. <laughs> I thought I was losing it for a second there. And then uh, we beat John Moxley, exploding barbed wire death. We're on the road to double or nothing. And we'll see what's waiting for us there, guys. And uh, if you guys like that video, if you like that exploding barbed wire death match, had some tense moments. I didn't think we were going to... There are times where I definitely didn't think I was going to be able to pull it out. But we got it done. If you guys liked it, though, you know what to do. Uh... And yeah, you guys have a good one. I will see you on the next one. Laters.